Alright people, welcome to a video. I am Wayne Quark. Boy have I got a video for you people. So recently, there are two things I want to talk about in this video. I'm going to keep it short because uh, a friend wants me to invite her in Minecraft. Um, but yeah. The first thing I want to talk about is people who deceive. So, and I'm not afraid to name names here, I really don't care. Because what they did is wrong. Alright. The first thing. I had a so-called brother and sister. The sister was Mary Elizabeth Marlowe. And the brother was, um, Noah Young. Like I said, I'm not afraid to name names, I really don't care. And what they did, you know, me and Noah had one fight, and yet, it, he fucking blocked me on Facebook, he blocked me on Facebook Messenger, and he overall tried to ruin my life. That's fine, I really don't give two shits about Noah, he can go fucking die in a hole or something like that. That's not what I'm worried about. The fact is, I was still friends with my sister Mary. At, you know, at the time, nowadays, she's just a total bitch. Don't even trust... Uh, uh, you know when I said subscribe to Blue Wolf Demon or Blue Demon Hunter or whatever the fuck her name is, I don't even care. I said to basically subscribe to her and watch her content. I take that back. Unsubscribe. Don't even subscribe. Don't. Don't. I, I'm telling you the truth. Don't. Just don't. Okay, and here's why. Everything was going right, everything was fine and dandy, and I, I just had something bad with a girlfriend happen, which wasn't even a girl to be honest, but I'll get into that in, in the second portion. I just said, hey, what's up? You know, trying to make sure she's okay. But then she blocked me on Facebook and Facebook Messenger for no fucking reason. I have a conspiracy. It's gotta be Noah Young. It has to be that piece of shit. You know, okay, here's the thing. I knew Mary. You know, I considered her my sister before, um, you know, Noah and Mary were boyfriend and girlfriend. And the thing is, Noah's 18. She's 14. Did you see the issue here? I mean, yes, I, to be honest, have dated girls that are younger, and I've also dated girls that are older. I've, da I've dated a girl that's like 18. I've also dated uh, several girls. I had two. That well, one was my age. Now, a little bit, maybe a little bit older, and one was 14. Now, I believe that true love it can conquer anything. Age doesn't matter, no matter what. That's why I believe. But not everyone feels strongly about that. And I, I, I respect that. But, you know, she blocked me on Facebook and Facebook Messenger. And no reason. And I got a feeling about Noah. Noah told her to do it. So, yeah. And until I hear otherwise, this that's, that's what my conclusion is. But as if that was not enough, I knew Mary, I consider her my sister before, like I said, Mary and, and Noah were a couple, were boyfriend and girlfriend. So, basically, here's the thing. I should have a say in this. I should be like, you know, I should at least talk to Mary, because I knew her m longer than she knew you. It doesn't matter if you're boyfriend or girlfriend. Family comes first. Even if it's like internet family. It still comes first. But I just don't really get that. Why? Up through one fucking fight. Noah just has to be a fucking retard and decide to ruin... Try to ruin my life. 
So if you ever get any messages from Noah talking about what I did, supposedly, don't trust him. Just a little word of, word of advice. Don't trust Noah. He's spewing lies like a bunch of baloney. And then I get to the second part of the video. The second part is people who lie about their identity. So recently I had a girlfriend. Yeah, girlfriend. It wasn't even a girl. Well, we, you know, I'll get to that later. So we were going good. You know, I thought you know, she was pretty cute because you know, she sent me a picture. She wasn't actually a she. So I had to have some, one of my friends. Uh, you know, I'm not gonna name him. He's too awesome. <laughs> But, uh, he, he had to tell me that, you know, he just had a conversation with, hey, are you gay? That was what he told me. That's what he asked me. I'm like, no, why? And he said, because Glizzy is a guy. At that point, I took my PS3 controller, you know, I was using the chat with people. I just, I dropped it. Because, like, I think I couldn't believe it. I've been catfished before. And stuff like that. But, you know, I actually thought that he was actually a girl. But no. First of all, he was gay. Which I don't, I don't have a problem with. I believe in gay marriage and shit. But if you try to turn me gay or whatever, I, that's, that's an issue. And this is a problem with dating on the internet. On the internet, you don't know if the person you're talking to is actually the person they say they are. You know, so they lie about their age, well not, well, not age, but they lie about their gender. Which made me look fucking stupid, okay? It made me look like, you know, it made me feel like I did something wrong. I mean, I'm, I'm not gay. I'm not bisexual. Alright? I'm as straight as a fucking line. And, you know, I, 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 yes, I am a girly girl. I act more feminine than I do manly, you know? I could really care less about if I'm a man, if I act like a man, if I act like a woman. I would actually much rather prefer to act like a female. But here's one thing I don't do. I don't, I repeat, I don't, I don't fucking lie about my actual identity. I tell people, hey, I'm a guy. Oh yes, I'm 17. Yes, I'm hideous. Okay? That's what I tell people. Because I don't mislead them into a false sense of security. You know, I've had, uh, I've had a few lesbians actually contact me, and it's like, are you a girl? And I'm like, no, no, sorry. I've also had guys do the same thing. It's like, are you a girl? And I'm like, no, I'm a guy. Hell, I've even had gay people ask me out too, and I'm like, no, no, sorry, I, I'm not that way. I guess I'm a guy, but I'm not that way. And it's horrible. Why would you lie? Why would you basically catfish people? Why would you lie about your identity? Why would you lie about everything? Because like, the picture that he sent me, you know, the person, Glizzy, it looked legit. It looked like that was actually him. It, you know, it was a girl. It was a really cute girl. I was actually hypnotized. I was like, I, I couldn't stop staring at the screen. I think I was drooling a little bit. Why would someone fucking lie about that shit? And because of this, I don't trust anyone. The more I try to trust people, the more they seem to be assholes. The more they seem to be a, a dick. The more they seem to disrespect me. I got a fucking fidget spinner here that can... Yeah, but, yeah, why? 
It makes no sense on any perspective. I mean, okay. Hell, they, people even lie about what they like. You know, I've had people that said that they love My Little Pony, and they actually do. Because I, I chat with them on Facebook Messenger, and they show me screenshots of them in their room uh, with Pony merchandise. And they have done video chats with me and, and voice chats and stuff. And they show me everything. So I know they're not lying. The same as PlayStation. And other stuff. But! I've also had people lie about it. It's like, yes, I love My Little Pony. But then, they later on to go and say, no, no, I, I hate My Little Pony. I, I don't, I, I just don't like it. And stuff like that. But you just said you liked My Little Pony before. Why did you lie to me? And, okay, here's the most hilarious part. I fucking told Glizzy, I told, you know, Glizzy's homicide, homicides, that, you know, what you did was wrong, and I fucking basically almost went out on a whole rant on that, on her, or him. Okay, so, get this. He was a guy that was pretending to be a girl. Hell, I, even I do that sometimes, to be honest. I, like I said, I'm a girly girl. I act more girly <clears throat> than I do as a man. You know, I act more of a girl than I do as a guy. <clears throat> but, it just makes no sense. And, you know, it, I don't understand. If you're so insecure about yourself, that you would literally fake your identity just to either prank someone or fucking do anything, it makes no sense. Why would you want to lie about your age? Why would you lie about your identity? Now, again, lying about your age, it doesn't matter. Like, I don't care. You know, age is just a number. I know, I, I know a lot of people actually do that, and I'm, I'm, I'm fine with that. But the fact that they lie about their gender to make me feel like I'm something I'm not. I'm not gay, like I said before. I'm not gay. I'm not bisexual. But I, you know, I, um, I accept all, the, all stuff like that. Like I believe everyone has the right to be happy and to be with whoever the fuck they want to be. But if you don't try to incorporate that into my life, I'm fine. But, I, I just don't know. I really don't know why anyone would just lie about that. It just pisses me off to know that this exists in the world. I've had people that's been, that have been catfished before. I've had people, you know, come to me and say I've been catfished, uh, and stuff like that. So now I'm single. Um, and I don't, I, I, I can't trust anyone. I just fucking can't. I try to trust people, and this is what happens. It just makes me sick. It fucking, it does. It really fucking does. It just, I don't understand people. I really don't know why people would just do that. Downright pisses me off. So, yeah, those are just two things I had on my mind that I'd like to share with you guys and gals. Uh, I hope to see you guys and gals soon. Peace. I hope you enjoyed.